Welcome. In front of me is a Redmi Note 10 Pro and today I'll show you how to enable and set up the portable hotspot. And to get started you want to find the toggle somewhere in the notification panel. So let me just quickly look for it. Oh, there it is, hotspot. So once you find the toggle, what you want to do is hold it. This will take us to the settings uh, or almost to the settings. So let's see, we have the... There we go, uh, set up portable hotspot, that's what we want to go. So as you can see right at the top we have the SSID, uh, complicated definition, but uh, or it's just some kind of weird name, but basically what the first option is, is just a name of the Wi-Fi, that's, that's all. So if you want the Wi-Fi to have a different name when you toggle it on, you can change it, change it to whatever you want, it doesn't really matter. And then below that we have something that does matter. Uh, it's gonna be the password. As you can see, uh, when you tap on the little eye icon, uh, the password that is set by default is just some absolute trash password. Uh, completely uh, not possible to remember. So let's remove this one and set our own. Now it does need to have eight characters in length. So let's make sure it does. And there we go. At which point you will be able to uh, save your password. Now, before I do so, I will also mention a couple different options right here. So we have security, I'll keep it as it is. Uh, if you change it, uh, you will basically disable uh, the password, meaning that anybody can connect to your network once you toggle it on. I uh, don't have um, a device under identification, uh, portable hotspot, we have also default, I'm not really sure what that is actually. Um, then we have uh, select AP band, uh, just the type of Wi-Fi. So we have 2.4 and 5 gigahertz. Uh, Personally, I would advise you to set it to 5 gigahertz, um, even though it does have some drawbacks. If you go with 5 gigahertz and your device isn't supported, um, that device just completely won't see that the hotspot they have created. And if that is the case, then all you need to do is go back here and drop it back to 2.4, which at that point it will work. Now, the reason why I advise you to at least try it is because the 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi will be uh, faster and more stable over the 2.4. So it is, uh, Going to be overly better that's why i advise you on it and that's about all the settings here so let's tap on the check mark to save them and from here we can go back to the toggle and our notification panel right over here tap on it and there we go as you can see tethering our hotspot active and that's it it's now enabled and you can connect to it and once you're done with it make sure you turn it off otherwise it will be using uh using up your battery for no reason so tap on it again and this will disable it now that being said, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.